Hey YouTube, Hannigan here with another episode of Geek K. So we're gonna do a, another unboxing today. It's gonna be also a blind unboxing. Um, it's gonna be the other loot crate that I mentioned in my last video, the add-on or additional box. Um, I believe this was like $10, so I'm not really expecting much. We'll see, excuse me, uh, what they have in store for us. So let's get into this unboxing, shall we? So first up, huh. hey, I had this already. But guess what, someone stole it, so I got it back and I needed it. So I am actually pretty happy about that. I don't know if uh, you can see what that is, but it is a little phone stress hearth stone. So yeah, I really like that. I am before, however, I, I, I lost my original one, so thoroughly happy that I've got it back. Um, although, it makes me wonder what's in this box, and maybe it's stuff I've already got before in other boxes, and it's just extra stuff we had lying around the warehouse. Let's find out. Let's leave the shirt for last. What's this? And I think it is actually a bunch of leftover items. They're trying to clear their inventory. Um, I did not get this one last time, but I did get a hex bug before. Um, this one is Scarab. So I'm not actually gonna open this because I didn't keep the last one. I gave it away as a gift. I will probably give this one away as well, um, just because I, it's not something that I really come with collect. So, yeah, hex bug. Moving on. I'm not even looking at this one. I'm gonna guess like shoelaces. Hey, guess what? I had four of these because they gave me extra in the last box. Marble shoelaces. Not even gonna give, you know, dignify that one because I've seen so many of them. What do we got now? I'm gonna guess this is a USB drive. Game of Thrones. Oh wow, I was right. A Game of Thrones USB drive. So this is obviously just, you know, they didn't really tell us what was in the box. It literally said, hey, $10 extra will give you an add-on box full of gear. I'm like, okay, sounds good to me. Um, but yeah, they're, they're literally just giving you extras of everything they've already given out. If there's a pop figure in here, Batman pop, I'm happy. Cause I didn't get that. Batman, uh, the, the Batman Joker or whatever, I want that. I doubt it, because this box is not big enough. Uh, there's a shirt in here, and I'm guessing I probably already, have, probably already have this shirt, but let's find out. First, something else. Hmm. Hmm. Don't think I got this one before, but I could be mistaken. Oh, I did. This is one half of an Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. badge, which has got to be in here somewhere. Oh, look at that. Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. badge. I think there's one more item, and this one is from the Terminator crate. It is a piece of, it is the, a keychain of Terminator. I have the Terminator right there. I can't really see it very well. Um, I don't have this displayed, but it's in a box full of keychains because they're hard to display um, at the moment. And oh, no, I don't actually, I did not get a shirt. I got socks. So I did not, I don't have these. What are these? They're Marvel, I think Thor. Can't tell. They're crew socks, and I don't wear crew socks, so there's that. But they are, nope, they are Doctor Strange. So, yeah, looks like they threw one extra item in here that was not new, and that is Doctor Strange socks. And that's what's in the box. So this is a really quick episode. I'm not even gonna go over 
like, you know, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not overly excited about a lot of this stuff. Uh, I'm happy that I got a replacement for this because I really like this and I do want to actually display this um, probably in my uh, Heroes of Storm Blizzard-esque area. Don't really care for anything else, uh, to be honest. It's in a junk box that I'm looking to try and get rid of at the moment anyways because it's all filler stuff. And this is literally just a filler box that I paid $10 for for the socks. Which I'm not going to wear. But, you know, because I mean, I might have worn it if it was actually a character that anyone cared about, but it's Doctor Strange who was a strange character comic series fellow. Not really primary superhero, so yeah. Uh, was not impressed with this box. Um, they're obviously just trying to get rid of stuff, which I've seen other stuff on this. They're, they're actually selling stuff off. You can actually buy a box that, um, a DC box or something like that, that has the Batman pop in it uh, for like 30 bucks. And you get the little Batman Q-pop and some other stuff, but I have everything but that, so $30 for a bunch of stuff I already have, plus, or just to get that one pop figure, which I'm not sure how much it sells online for, I'd have to look that up, but I could probably find it for around $15 to $20 if I actually really tried, um, because let's face it, a lot of people got Loot Crate, and there's probably a lot of them out there, so it's not, not that exclusive. Um, when I go to get it down the road. So, all in all, was not a fan, but it was under ten dollars, and that's including shipping. So couldn't argue. Uh, pass that deal up just to see what it was and what it was about, to see what they're doing and whatnot. So ultimately, a lot of weight because this it is like the twenty eighth of the month right now as I'm filming this. So, and Luke great always arrives on the 28th. They are religious about that. Always arriving, rely, always arriving on the same exact day. And they actually have it in their law in their like little user agreement. If it arrives past the 28th, no matter where you are in the world, if you order Loot Crate and it arrives past the 28th, there might be some exceptions, I'm not sure specifically, um, then they will compensate you. But it always arrives on the 28th for me. Don't know why. Um, it used to, and that's only since I got here, um, I was actually further away, like, um, like, like, literally, if you're going away from where this is shipping from, where it says it's shipping from, um, I, I lived further from that destination point, and the box would arrive a week sooner. How does that work? I don't know. But, I digress. Um, so, yeah. As always, Hanneken, this is episode of Geek K. Thanks for watching YouTube. Subscribe. Comment. We'll see you next time.